I say yo, I said I'm back with another video. Hey, listen, bro. In today's video, I'm gonna be showing y'all boys how to use Band Lab, how to make a professional song using Band Lab. Do I like the herpes? Yeah. <laughs> Listen, but in today's video, just like I was saying, bro, I'm gonna be showing y'all boys how to use how to make a professional song using band lab. So that's, that's the reason I clicked on it. So you know you your song be sounding kind of iffy. So yeah, I'm I, I got you. Don't don't feel shy. I got you. I ain't gonna tell nobody. Just leave a comment, bro. Leave a comment if you need help with anything else. So yeah, I'm gonna show y'all boys how to make a professional song. I'm gonna be showing y'all boys how to make clean vocals. I'm gonna show you boys how to punch in. I'm gonna show you how to use presets. I'm gonna show y'all boys how to be a pro. You feel me? If you are new, bro, I just wanna let you know, I react to band loud rappers, hey. Check my videos out, hey, if you see what you like, just, why am I spitting it, bro? If you see what you like, bro, go ahead and go ahead and subscribe with post notification, cause you do not wanna miss no videos, bro. Like, bro, we on the road to hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year. Go ahead and subscribe with post notifications on, bro, because we don't hit 10,000 subscribers by the end of this year, bro. I might quit YouTube, I ain't gonna hold you, bro. I ain't gonna lie. I'm lying. <laughs> Balls you can download BandLab on your iPhone, on your and Android. I'm talking about your Android and your and your uh, desktop. So you got no excuse in making a song if you want to be an artist when you grow up, or if that's what you're aiming for to be your dream job. So yeah, you got no excuse. Start on BandLab to you know what I'm saying. Practice, get better, better, better and better. I say become professional to when you go in the studios, all the extra stuff. But yeah, but listen, the first thing you, the first two things you need for band to make a song using BandLab, a phone. And some earbuds, you feel me? Some Apple, the Apple ones right here, you can see that these Apple ones are the best ones to use. I don't know about the ones that you go to get at the gas station or the ones you go get at Walmart or the ones you get at IGA. I don't know what y'all doing buying some earbuds at a um, grocery store. I'm, <laughs> do not ask me, I, <laughs> these Apple. But anyway, but listen, if you're gonna up it up a little bit, you got your sound to sound a little crispy, a little professional, you trying to go crazy, bro, listen. You can um, get a USB microphone such as a blue small ball that is very cheap or a blue Yeti. Just like this one I got right here. As you can see, this black one right here. If y'all want me to upload the video showing y'all boys how to use a USB microphone using BandLab, hey, let me know, bro. Hey, anything I need, leave it in the comments. Even if you're not trying to say hi, leave it in the comments, bro. If you had a good day, leave it in the comments. Your address, leave it in the comments, bro. Your SSN, leave it in the comments, bro. But your debit card or your credit card number and all that extra stuff, bro. Hey, y'all not hey, DM me that because you know what I'm saying? I'm trying to be the first one to get to you. Feel me? Hey, I'm, I'm greedy. So, yeah, go ahead and do that, bro. Yo, 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 yo. <laughs> Leave it in the comments, bro. You know what I'm saying? Anything you need, I got you. Hey, hey yo. Nigga, what is you looking at, my nigga? Goddamn. Listen, I want y'all listen, bro. Before we start with the video, I'm like, I gotta tell you the fundamental before you even make a song, bro. The first thing first, you gotta make sure, my boy. Make sure you have a beat. You know what I'm saying? Make sure you have a good beat. The second thing, this is, more, this is the most important thing, bro. Make sure you do not make a song like, you see this plate right here? This, this room right here, it's a big echo, echo, echo location. And you can't make a song if you got your kids running around. Get them kids and put them in daycare, you feel me? You trying to make a professional song, right? You trying to make them kids eat with your music career, right? So yeah, put them, them kids in daycare or whoop them, you feel me? Hit them or something. Best place to make your song, bro, is in a closet. Honestly, I try to make it in here. I try to make it in the bathroom. The bathroom is the most place that's very echo. You feel me? Like, you go try yourself. Watch you get a whole reverb in there. You know what I'm saying? It, it, is, it is very echo. It's in your closet in between your clothes. Like, say you got a shirt right here, a shirt right that's uh, hanged up. You got a bunch of clothes. Like, make it in there. I'm telling you, like, it's gonna sound, it's gonna sound clean, but don't, and don't speak too loud in your peas. You feel me? Don't, when you're making a song, don't push the peas too hard because you're making a song. Don't push the P like this, this close, you feel me? You gonna wanna like, put the cheek, put the mic on for here and just talk this way. Don't, we don't want that, I don't wanna hear that. I'm not. The things I'm gonna show you in today's video, bro, is um, I'm gonna show y'all boys how to punch in. If you don't know how to punch in, bro, punching in is like, you gonna use one, um, use one track and use a second track. Like, you go ahead and go one track and then you mess up and then you punch back in with the second track. You know what I'm saying? You gotta use multiple tracks when you're making a song. You do not wanna use one track. I always use multiple tracks to make it sound good so you always can go back and forth, back and forth, punch it in so it can sound very, very good. The next thing I'm gonna show you boys is how to use presets. This is one of the most important things to use in band life is presets. If you do not use presets, the song is gonna sound very, very raw. So I'm gonna show you boys how to use presets. And if y'all want me to show y'all how to create a preset, 
presets, let me know in the comments. If y'all want me to show or uh, give y'all my presets or y'all want me to create presets for y'all, you sound like a specific person, let me know. Leave it in the comments. I'm about to go ahead and show y'all boys how to record. I can't show y'all while I'm standing up because I'm only using one phone. So yeah, I'm going to show y'all how to make a professional song using your phone. Hopefully y'all don't take up too much y'all time because I talk too much. Let's get it. As you can see right now, now I'm in band lab. As you can see right here, uh, this blue track right here, this blue track, this is my beat right here. Okay, the first thing you wanna do is add a uh, first track, you feel me? Add your, uh, this the track right here you wanna uh, put your vocals on. And as you can see, this is this second track right here. This is my vocal track. And to, you gonna try to add a preset, right? as you can see. Uh, this the, yeah, hold up. Yeah, this the preset I'm gonna use right here, you feel me? I just made this preset just now. As you can see, got an echo and everything. If y'all want me to, uh, what is it? If y'all want this preset right here, y'all let me know, cause uh, it's not that good with my voice, but I kind of like it. I'm so that's, that's what I'm gonna use for this for this video and whatever. I just don't like hearing myself, but I gotta do this so y'all can hear me. As you can see right here, this where you go for your auto tuning, whatever. You go, you click on auto pitch, for your auto tune. But you know what I'm saying? I don't use auto tune, so I'm gonna keep. It. I'm gonna turn that off. This, as you can see, you can use this. These 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 right here are um. Um, band lab presets right here. These the you can customize them however you want. As you can see, they all different right here. Look at that. Are these they they, they, they are right, but you can make your own. As you can, you can click none and start from scratch and make your own presets right here. This way, this is how you make your presets right over here. You just click this. You go through all these and, and adjust it however you like it. Make your own presets. As you can see, I got multiple, 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 multiple. But yeah. If y'all want it, this the preset I'm gonna use for today's video. But yeah, like I said, I'm not gonna show y'all how to create a preset, but I'm gonna y'all gonna have to use preset. If y'all want this preset, let me know. It is very clean, I ain't gonna lie. Alright. As you can see, like I said, the first track, the first thing you wanna do, but make sure you put your beat on top. That's the blue track. The second track right here, that's my uh for the vocals. So what you wanna do is slide it is three dots right here on the second track and duplicate. Boom, as you can see, all these two sound the same. And as you can see, when I click on beat, I'm saying you don't, you don't got a preset. It's this the raw. You don't want to use raw. You don't want to use your preset. As you can see, this the beat I'm going to use right here. Easy. Shine Easy money. Money. I feel like I'm talking too much, but let me go ahead and dive in. I'm going to go ahead and just say some quick stuff right quick. Y'all going to see like how I just... I take one to me. Let's get it. I try this beat. Shine right money. Drop it. Hey, boy. Hey, listen, I'm recording. As you can see, that's me my hook right there. As you can see, this the hook. I just finished recording that, and now I gotta go to. Now I'm gonna show y'all boys how to uh punch in. Okay, I don't, I don't like how he's like echoing all that stuff, but this second track right here. Yeah, this blue one, I mean this purple one, I'm going to show y'all, this is how you punch in right here. As you can see, I stop. You do not want to go ahead and just punch back in with the same track. That right there is going to be, don't ever do that. I don't know why people, I see some people do it, but do not do it. Use a second track to punch in. Or you can make a third track. Yeah, like again, you can duplicate, make a third track. But I like to make two, three tracks, but I don't need to punch in like that. But let me get this second verse in. I already know what I'm Trust me, bro. I don't know how to make songs like that, but hey, like I said, this look, I'm, uh, I'm, it's a freestyle. Like I'm saying, I'm just going very fast with it. As you can see, this is punching in. As you can see, okay, you see this little, this, the second track, right? This line right here. What we're trying to do is go right here, right, and just cut it. Huh? Get it out the way. Bam. You see how this is just very close. Don't ever, cause you don't want to cut every. You don't want to ever cut this little piece right here on the top track. So, don't do that. Now as you can see, let me show you how it sounds. I try this beat right now. Money dropping heat, boy. Hey, right now I'm recording. Let me get a read right here. Alright, that's this one. That's what I'm using. Okay, I'm gonna 
Okay, as you can see, the beat is way harder than my vocals. So what I want to do is just go back and just go right here, right? This is what I'm to adjust the sound for the beat. So you got to listen to it while it plays so you can know how low or high you want the beat to be. Feel me? So let me just start from right here. See, bro, it is that easy to make a professional. All you need is a preset to make it sound clean, bro. That's all you need, bro. But what is it? If you want to add ad libs, I forgot to, yeah, ad libs. All you want to do, make a a different track, right? You can use the same one. You can use, oh, not that one. I can use this one if I want to. As you can, this one is like a bunch of echo. I can't. What I like to use is, uh, I think this one. But, yeah, I'm gonna use this one. I'm gonna use this one. I don't know what I'm gonna say, but I'm gonna turn it down because I like my life. My ad libs are very, very low. Let's see. I don't know if I'm gonna use it. I just this one. That's what I'm gonna use. As you can see, you can hear the my, uh, my, uh, what is it? My ad libs. These, I call these ad libs because I don't know. I just yeah, these my ad libs. These ad libs like to use whenever I use these type of songs. But yeah. You can hear it a little bit. I mean, it sounds good to me, but hopefully, I don't know. Y'all might have a different taste, or yeah, I'm just showing y'all boys how to record. Yeah. Basically. I'm about to show y'all why you need presets on your songs whenever you make a song. So I'm about to start from the beginning. I right, try this beat. I'm gonna use right here. You feel me? As you can see right now, I'm recording. Let me get a read right here. Alright, this this one. That's what I'm gonna use. Right falling, falling. I've been falling, falling, falling. I've been falling, falling, falling. I've been falling, falling, falling. I've been, I've been falling for fate. I've been falling for snake. I've been running around, I didn't open up my eyes, if you really do me wrong, this a me, this a song. <laughs> it sound, it sound terrible, like, you feel like, see how the difference? To me, it is straight up to me, but like I said, bro, this is this was nothing but a, uh, a tutorial showing y'all boys how to use BandLab, how to make your song very clean. Basically, to make your song very clean, as you can see, like when I showed y'all to cut this piece out, that's how make it sound clean. If you want to make it clean, go somewhere that's very quiet. You don't want to go in a loud place because, see, say say I was rapping right here, right? If I was singing during this part right here. Like when you got somebody running in the background, there's no way to take that person running in the background out. So yeah, the only time you can do that, if this track is kind of let me, or this, if it's like this, like you you want to every time like your track is like this, you gonna wanna cut it like that. Cut that little piece out like that, you be straight. You feel me? You don't want, yo, you don't want to hear that background. You don't want to hit that. You wanna cut it like right here. You wanna cut about right here and just. Cut it out. Cut it out. Yeah, just like that.
Basically, bro, I don't know what else to show y'all. As you can see up here, you can write your uh, lyrics. I don't like, I don't write lyrics at all. I just, I don't freestyle. I just punch in. Basically, like I said, right, like this right here. This is punching in. From this track to that track, I just that's punching in. You do not, like I said, bro. You do not want to just go off of one track your whole song. Punch in, make multiple tracks. Like if I was actually rapping, punching in, I would have made three purple tracks, being my main vocals, punching in like that. So yeah, hopefully I enjoyed this video, bro. That'll be the rest of this video. If I missed anything, or if y'all want to make a part two, let me know. Leave it in the comments. Anything I need, leave it in the comments. If y'all want me to give y'all this preset right here, because with my voice, like my regular, I'm using my regular voice right now talking. So y'all voice might be like a little bit better than mine. So using this preset, hey, you could. You know what I'm saying, let me let me know, cause I don't know if y'all need this preset, so I'm not gonna give it to y'all if you don't want it. But yeah, let me know if you want this preset. Leave it in the comments. Hopefully I enjoyed this video. Who's your boy Willow? Play me like I'm stupid Run up, shoot your bitch, call me Cupid I made a fall in love I was medicated off for of every type of drug But I had enough I stay, I stay too fucked up Roll up my gram and I sip on my double cup